June 2008, Mother Nature sets her sights on Indiana. Some of the land mass that's covered with water does indeed look like the ocean. We asked you to help the Salvation Army Emergency Disaster Services, and you responded generously. Hey, uh, we got Allison here who just stopped by. Did you hear us on the radio or what? I sure did. Yeah. I came by, signed a check, and I just gave it to you. Super easy. Indianapolis Mayor Greg Ballard. It is amazing to see, but it's also amazing to see all the people who come in and help out. Oh, my pleasure, really. Uh, Salvation Army is a great, great organization. We're making money, literally. Okay. Hey, thanks for the donation, man. We are here and uh, taking more donations for the Salvation Army and uh, flood relief. And uh, what is your name, Jason? Jared. This is Jared right here. How old are you? Tell me how you, uh, how many, uh, how do you get these donations? Um, by doing a popsicle stand. And, like, we sell popsicles for, like, 25 cents or... Mm, popsicles. All right, now you get the good luck. you got to put all that into that. So you got to take it out and you got to pop it in. You fold it up. The money's up. Put the coins in there. All right, good luck. $21,205 with money still coming in. Intercom Cares and sort of the people of Indianapolis. This has been an incredible day, and, you know, we're just overwhelmed by how much uh, folks turned out today to give. Hi! I'm Tom Cattles, KDR-TV6, American Red Cross Storm Relief, and joining me now is Dave Matthews. <laughs> oh, no, Dave's my <laughs> Intercom Communications is proud to have been a part of the flood recovery efforts. We asked you to help the Salvation Army Emergency Disaster Services, and you responded generously. Our total is close to exceeding $25,000. Intercom cares for Indiana.